Hello, good people. I hope you all are doing well out there. Welcome to Brown Bag Tarot. Welcome back if you're returning. Put these back in here. All right, I'm about to tear open a bag for the cancer. Okay, love reading. Um, I'm going to split the energies between the cancer and the person that's on the cancer's mind. If you need to switch the placements, do so. But I'd split them because I don't want to be confused. So let's get straight into it. Thank you, Spirit. Y'all hit that like button for me. Subscribe to the channel if you would, please. Uh, let's get into it. Thank you, Spirit. What's in the Cancer's bag concerning love at this time? Please and thank you. One. Two. Messages. Caution. Destiny. All right, you're going to be getting some messages, some type of correspondence. Okay. I feel like it's not going to put you at ease. But whatever it is, it's, it's for your destiny here. What's, what's, what's in your person's energy? One. Two. Three. Stability, hope, opportunity. Might be dealing with a Leo. Leo got the same kind of message here. Your person is hoping for some stability with you. Mm -hmm. Wishing on a star somewhere over the rainbow. They got a lot of, they got some hope. For stability with you, Cancer. All right, but let's get into it. You are going to get some messages from your person. What kind of messages? What kind of messages? Tell me about these messages, Spirit. One, two, three. Tell me about these messages, Spirit. Just breathe. They want you to relax. They want you to relax. They want you to be yourself. They see you as wife material. I feel like you're going to get a message, something like that. I feel like they're going to be telling you, listen, you can, you can relax. I'm not going to, I'm not going to hurt you. You can be yourself. You're fine. You're cool. Just the way that you are. I love you just the way that you are, you know, um, just come back. Be yourself. I feel like they're going to be saying just be yourself. All right? In terms of caution. Simply love. Six of Cups. Six of Pentacles. Ace of Wands. I feel... Uh, uh, I feel... Actually, I'm going to change that because this is your side, Cancer. I feel like you're going to be telling somebody, no, I am myself. I'm just going to be myself. You're going to have to take it or leave it. Okay, I'm me, boo. I'm going to let my light shine. I'm going to be the beautiful empress that I am. Okay, I'm not changing myself for you. I'm not going to let you make me over. It is what it is. Take it or leave it. Okay. Um, I feel like you do want to give and receive with your person, but every time I see the six of cups, that always lets me know that it hasn't been all wine and roses in the situation. I feel like you do want to give and receive with your person. I feel like you do want it to be an equal give and take with your person but again the seven of cups is like but mm, let me let me think about this but i think you're thinking more toward a new beginning okay you say but listen if we're gonna have a new beginning i i am who i am i eat peanut butter in the bed i do and if you don't like that you're just gonna have to get used to it flat out <laughs> flat out okay 
I'm going to click this back. Tell me about destiny. Tell me about destiny. Tell me about the destiny card. Okay. The devil. Master. I feel like you've mastered your heart. Cancers, y'all, y'all love love. Y'all do. Y'all like walk in love. If love was a person, it would be cancer. But I feel like you got your heart locked up a little bit because you're not pouring your love out the way that you used to. Eight of cups, nine of cups. Yeah, I feel like you've walked away from the situation, going to make your own dreams come true. And I feel like making your own dreams come true is just you standing in your truth. You know, um, you're not pouring your heart out like it was before. You're not wearing your heart on your sleeve anymore. But in that also, I feel like you want to, but because again, it's like letting your light shine. You was like, listen, me shining is me letting my heart out, me wearing my heart on my sleeve, me being openly emotional. That's me. Okay, and I want to be able to do that. I want to be able to make my dreams come true by doing that. Okay, and if I'm going to be giving and receiving with you, I'm going to do that. But you can't just be stepping on my heart because I walk away from you. I sure will. I will walk away from you and still wear my heart on my sleeve, period. It is my destiny to let my heart out. Yeah, I feel like your heart has been locked up and, and that, that hurts your heart. Because again, cancers are walking love. World card, you know, like, hey, I'm I'm ending this not being able to love freely like I was because I had to lock my heart up because you was acting like the damn devil. What is wrong with you? Okay, so I feel like this Ace of Wands is more so for you. You know, because that's action. And it's like, I'm about to put my action back on by let my heart out again okay again so if i let you back in i'm not gonna let you i'm not gonna let you shit on my heart yeah because you had you came out with the four swords you've been resting you've been resting because your heart has been locked up Okay, but that's not rest for the cancer. That's like turmoil for cancer. You had to lock your heart up because of whoever you was dealing with. But I feel like you want to tell your person, like, listen, Ace of Wands, let's try to do this. But I am who I am. I am. Maybe they thought you were overly emotional or something, you know. But I feel like you're saying, listen, if we're going to be together, yeah, sometimes I am. And if you can't deal with that, well, beat it. <laughs> I kind of like it. I kind of like it. Let me be great. <laughs> Tell me about your person's stability here. Oh, man, y'all got the lovers. Could be dealing with a Gemini. Could also be dealing with the Capricorn or a Taurus. <laughs> Crown chakra, seeking the truth, seven of swords, five of swords. <sighs> hmm. I don't know how I feel about that seven of swords, five of swords with the crown chakra. I don't like that. You know, I don't like it because those are two very most like mentally manipulative energies, especially with that third eye, you know, I hope your person doesn't feel like they think they can mentally manipulate you by coming in with being all lovey dovey. Like, oh yeah, we can get anchored again. If I tell you, if I tell you that I love you, even though I might not act like it because I don't like five of swords and seven of swords together. I don't like that. And the third eye too. That's I don't I don't like that. 
It's like their intuition is just saying, maybe I could just tell them that I love them and they'd take me back and be stable. I don't think the cancer is that stupid. I think the cancer is like, mm -mm. I want to, but I need to be able to let my heart sing. Hope. They got the heart chakra. Spread your wings. And heal them. So it's like, I feel like they hope you see that they have healed. Have they healed, Father? I, I, I need to clarify. Between you two is the relationship card. I just want to, I need to clarify this. This is the first time I've had to clarify. Have they healed? Have they healed? Because this feels mentally manipulative. Okay? Because cancers have their heart locked up. They don't want their heart locked up. You know? And, and, and again, it's like feeling like the cancer was overly emotional, which is what cancers do. Okay? And your person may not have liked that. Like, you too emotional, you too needy, you too mushy, you too this, that, and the other, and blah, 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 you know. But I, I feel like, you know, and, and you locked your heart up, Cancer. But I feel like your person over here is like, yeah, let's let's be stable. Let's Let's have some hope. For the relationship. So it's like an energy of them saying what 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 you want to hear. You know. Tell me, tell me about this healing. Oh, I've healed. I don't mind if you're mushy. I don't mind if you're emotional. You know, but again, it's like it's cold. Like their heart is cold as ice. You know, that's that's what I'm getting from here. Their heart is cold as ice. But let me clarify this a little further. Why's 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 this card here this healing yeah this man look all stoic ten of wands five of swords again with the ace of pentacles yeah it's like your person want to win it's like they tired of you not being around they do want a new beginning with you but it's like they want it on their own terms so I feel like they're willing to tell you what it is that you want to hear, but it may not be the truth because they pulled the five of swords twice. And that's a very selfish card. With the ace of wands, you know, that, that looks like a male phallic to me. You know, let me let me put this this thing on you. So you can start loving me again. They do want a new beginning, but on their terms. Tell me about this five of swords, five of, five of swords, seven of swords. Tell me about that. Why is that here? Ooh, ace of swords. Now that's the truth, Ruth. That's the truth. King of Pentacles, two of wands. Six of wands. They want to be successful. They they do want a new relationship with you. Okay. And this is my relationship card. Okay. But again, this King of Pentacles, his back is turned. Y'all might have kids together. Okay. So I feel like he wants y'all to come back together. I feel like he's willing to tell you whatever it is that you want to hear. Okay. But it's something about what they saying that's like some bullshit because with this ace of wands here is like the truth is stopping somebody or somebody's truth is going to stop somebody dead in their tracks like uh -huh, wait a minute wait a minute it's going to stop them dead in their tracks it's something about what your partner is saying i feel like that's not all the way true that five of swords two times gives me pause all right, but I feel like they do want a new beginning with you. They are going to tell you whatever it is that you want to hear. So you can get on board 
They're tired of you not being around, but they they not going to really act right. They 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 want to be successful in getting you back. And whatever it is, see and and, and that's the messages. I feel like you may reach out to them, Cancer, and then they're going to be like, "Yeah, whatever you say, baby." Yep, whatever you say, I'm with that. Whatever you say. Yep. Mm-hmm. We could rebuild our home. I'm tired of being without you. Yeah, let's spread our wings. Let's get it together. But they heart cold as ice. They're not really in it to win it. They in it to win. Like, like they're not in it to have can I put it? It doesn't feel like equal give and take. It feels like they just want to get back in the house. Like, let me back in the house. Whatever I need to say, whatever you say, cool, bet. Yeah, let's do it. Great. You know, but I feel like it's not coming from a loving place. It's coming from a, I just want to win place. Because at a point, you got to a place, Cancer, where you couldn't be your true self, but you want to be. And the person, it feels like, it's like, whatever, whatever you say, just let me back in the house. I don't know how to feel about it. I don't like it. What's the advice for Cancer Spirit? What's the advice for cancer? That's a lot. Well, 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 it is the six of wands, victory and success. I feel like you want the relationship to be successful. I do. Um, could be dealing with a Scorpio. I do feel like you want the situation to change. I do feel like you've been in your head a lot. I do feel like you want your person back. I feel like you're going to reach out to them and tell them what it's going to take for them to be able to come back. And I feel like your person is going to be like, exactly, baby, whatever you say, they're going to go along with whatever you say, just so they can get back in the house. Not because they real loving, because I don't see no cups here. Okay, but I'm tired of being out here by myself. Let me back in the house. They ain't going to act right, but they just want to get back in the house. That's how I feel. But anyway, that's what I got for the cancer. Hit that like button for me. Subscribe to the channel. And uh, if this resonates with you, leave it in the comment section. Because I love to hear your feedback. And until the next time we get together at Brown Bag Tarot, you guys, I encourage you all to pack light and y'all be cool.